What the fuck is up, Kyle? Have you found anything? Nothing is there. No pages, nothing. That cannot be. Something must be special about them. Think. I'm done thinking. These paintings are a blank slate. Yeah, I don't think it's your forte. Salai, doesn't Leonardo conceal his research? He frequently writes backwards. Ezio, he also experimented with inks, including an ink that vanishes. But we can't see invisible ink. Can we? Ezio, use your gift. You know about that too? <laughs> Puzzle mission time. That painting might have more, no? I will return to this one later. There are drawings on the painting. We were right. Found the know then. Went to check, no demo. No. On Steam. This one has been searched entirely. Uh, I'll check it out after I'm done streaming. Got one. Which will be fairly soon because this DLC kind of goes by pretty quickly. You have finished with that one, I see. It's just that I'm stupid and make it uh, take forever. <laughs> I found one. I think I'd rather do the 16 puzzles. To drawings. On another note, what to talk about? I see a drawing. What the game? Or just in general? Oh, I remember this one being fucking annoying. Because this one's in a place that don't make no sense. Not in the corners. Everything General. found. Uh, one. one drawing here. These one as well. Found it. I have found all the images. They seem to fit together. Draw them already. 
Bring me paper and ink. Batman game. Is that a map? Show me the entrance. I must first position it pieces. I mean, I don't know about Wait. more. What about the burned paintings? It is likely the missing parts will not be needed. Care to bet on that? In Batman game without no. What, what game are we talking about? Oh, new Batman game. New Batman game. Yeah. Yeah, it's not looking. Not looking too hot, that game. Yeah, because I was all for it at the start. I'm like, oh, ooh, cool, another Arkham game. And then it was like, ooh, ooh, ew. <laughs> Looking a lot like the Avengers game, yeah. Which is unfortunate as fuck. Everything gotta be an Avengers game now. Apparently they're also talking about making a uh, a straight up solo Black Panther game, but it's it's apparently in the uh, the pre stages. Let's start over. Let's start over on this thing. Bought Avengers game on sale for five bucks and it and felt ripped off. That's because really the the only real thing that it had going for it was the, was for me anyway was the story and the story was ass. I mean, it's it's cool that it focuses on Miss Marvel, but you know, ew. The rest of the game was just gross, especially because apparently the. Uh, so I remember, I remember downloading the demo back before it uh, before it launched. And I played that. And even that was like, ew. think what was it uh, they hadn't uh, they hadn't put all the voice lines in there yet so uh, you 
one of the lines was of the Hulk was the Hulk going agreeable grunt, and apparently that made it into the main game. Played the beta, it was gross. Went from this could be cool to oh no. The action wasn't even fun. Skyrim combat had more impact. Yeah. They're, they were very spongy in that game. Here, the entrance to the catacombs. Go. Bring him back to me. Hang on, old friend. I am coming. The Avengers game flopped, but did it flop as hard as Anthem? Thor's hammer sounds like you're smacking someone with an aluminum can. Also, how in the fuck did Thor get a regular job without everyone in the world not knowing who he was? That's my biggest question. But yeah, the the Avengers game for me at least was another one of those situations where I got I got fooled by the the quote unquote the quote unquote gameplay trailer that they came out where all the Avengers were fighting on the bridge and shit. And I'm like, wow, is this the gameplay? This actually looks interesting. And then as it got further and further along, more and more questions popped up and then I played the beta. And I was like, oh, this is gross. And then just like with that just like with Outriders, I dodged a bullet. Even though I had fun with Outriders. At least the demo anyway. Uh, he does not talk normal. Well isn't that the point? On the bright side, he's got Travis Willingham as his voice actor. On the downside, it sounds like he has brain damage. <laughs> Tell me where the entrance is. It's a, it was it's especially bothersome considering how they it's not it's not the same thing but uh, considering how they wanted to portray how they've been portraying Thor since his first movie because it was that one scene where he's like drinking coffee in a coffee shop and he apparently had never had coffee before And uh, they, uh, er, all of, ever since that, they've been categorizing as just this dumb idiot who doesn't know what anything is. When, on one hand, yes, he is a god from another, a quote-unquote god being from another dimension that uh, strangely seems like Nordic-inspired. But on the other hand, the people who made his mythology knew what coffee was by their time, so shut up. 
hired as lumberjack and candidate, along with doing Superman. Blonde Superman. Aren't they? Isn't Rocksteady making a Superman game behind the? Uh, on top of making that suicide game, or were at least in the talks of doing it. Ezio Auditore, you who arrested Cesare Borgia, who stopped the spread of Roman ignorance, convince our friend Leonardo to open the temple and usher in the golden age of mankind. Do I persuade our friend by kicking him? Or would you rather I use my knife? On the contrary, there is nothing I would like more than an amiable solution. Help Leonardo see reason. With the Pythagorean Unifar, we will remake humanity together. Not under my creed. Then the revolution will begin without you. Ucciderlo! Get back! You'd be down for a Superman game? Wonder Woman game would be cool. I mean, just just a good, decent Justice League game that isn't Justice League Online would be fine. Oh yeah, I remember seeing the, uh, I remember seeing the, the, the announcement trailer for the Wonder Woman game. I completely forgot that was a thing. Go! Stop him! Ah! Very foolish. And I remember watching that one too. Stay away from me, assassino! We are all the same underneath, yet these people persist in their witch hunts! You By the studio that made Shadow of War. Could be fine. You... an assassin? The enemy of knowledge? One must choose to search for truth. I mean, I kind of thought Shadow of War accomplishes little. got a bit These too long in the tooth and kind of lost the plot at some point, but I did like kingdoms. the Shadow of Mordor and Shadow I of War games. ended their suffering. Che tu possa conoscere la verità nella morte. Requiescat in pace. Come, let us leave this place. We cannot, Ezio. Not without reaching the final room of the temple. Ow. You are hurt. I will be fine. If that number is left intact, we risk another madman discovering it. I've had my arm on this armrest for so long that it's got an indention in it now. Thank they relied a little too hard on the Nemesis system. It delayed their progress significantly. I mean, the Nemesis system was the whole reason for, you know, playing that game, really. But it just got too... Like I said, it got too long in the tooth. And it just... Just kept going. The Pythagoreans believe that the soul moved to parts oh, of the box orcs. like a beam yep. of light. It ignites fire, which symbolizes knowledge. I mean, really? Really the crime is the fact that they... Uh... Uh... Trademarked the nemesis system so now only only they can use the nemesis system which is like oh cool so what have you done with the nemesis system nothing okay <laughs> you've done nothing with it since that game ended 
And how long ago was that? All right, cool. Why did you want to trademark this again? If you're, you know, not gonna do any fucking thing with it. Cool. <laughs> Because Wonder Woman's gonna use it. I don't know. All we know about Wonder Woman game was that trailer. So I don't know shit. Who would the who would the enemy faction be? Like Demon Ares slaves? Since Ares is your villain, or would it just be Cheetah again? Cheetah minions. <laughs> being generous trailers are always generous we must continue onward that's why I, I suppose Salah is out having fun spending my ardent florins he is safe at home I am relieved about the florins of course you do not need to lie to me Salah fits you I approve I am Leonardo da Vinci at a loss for words that is a first Ares is like a good pick, but well, that's like, that's like her number one villain. So if they don't, it would be kind of a this room could use some light. misstep, I think. But yeah, that's like one of the main reasons why I don't wa watch any of those like game award that. The sound of wind. trailer things, because I'm just like, uh, once that once they release a decently looking gameplay trailer, I'll watch that. But other than that, don't show me anything until you're ready to. The Pythagoreans believed all the forces of nature could be whittled down to numbers. Mathematica can then act on nature, allowing man to harness nature's power. Just like what everybody thought was happening with uh, Bayonetta 3. It's the, it's the such and such quarter of the year. You gotta show something, Platinum. Uh, we're not really ready to show anything about it yet, but we can whip up a quick trailer for Bayo 3 right quick. Do that. Now I can get back up here. But we've barely we, we've, we've barely started work. Do it. You need something to show for the quarter. Do it. Release the trailer five years before you have anything concrete to show. Okay. I hate when they tell a game well tells a game well good when you can come out five years. yeah okay you we, we were on the same mind with that then <laughs> I didn't even see your comment before I made that five years thing <laughs> the wheel is turning you are channeling the air keep going perfect route up if I fall Yeah, yeah, you did, but I didn't even read it when I said it, and then I looked down and I saw that, and it's like, oh, we were thinking the exact same time frame. Cool. <laughs> that's what... That's...
Only one final room before we reach the center. That's why I made that comment earlier in the stream about... They show off close to release most of the time. Bethesda. Except for Starfield. Which I don't know about Starfield either. Or Elder Scrolls 6. Wait, did that did that last did the last time they talk about Elder Scrolls 6, did they give a date? I don't remember. Well, those were mostly just trailers. Correct. Harmony was achieved for the but like I said, you know, multiplicity became executive man says that we get the developers got to have something to show idea. for Q4 so that it looks like we're not just sitting on our ass. So whip up a quick trailer that whip up a quick vague trailer that means nothing so that we can show it at the game awards. Scroll 6 is going to be around five years after yes. Starfield. How enlightening. Very funny. And when's Starfield coming out? Next year? Or two years? I don't remember. I didn't actually... I didn't watch... I know they came out with a trailer for like some like gameplay type thing, but I haven't watched it yet. Next year. Okay. Well, at least that. I mean, probably, the, probably the only reason that they had any, probably the only reason they had anything to show at the start is because they got bought by Microsoft. Microsoft's like, do some shit with your stuff for fuck's sake. They were like, okay, okay. Here's a gameplay trailer. You happy? Microsoft was like, yes, thank you. They were gonna do November, but got delayed. November. Why? Because Skyrim. Again. November. <laughs> if it... Oh, God. How the fuck did I do that? If it came out and said November 11th, I was gonna la I'm gonna laugh my ass off. But I guess it didn't. Eleven years after, eleven years after Skyrim, we present to you Skyrim in space. I just spit all over my keyboard. Unity is achieved, but the door is not opening. Oh, oh, shit, bitch! Oh. Leonardo, come here. Recognize these symbols? No. Wait. These are Fallout the symbols space. that were shown to me by the Apple of Eden. They are in the wrong order. Let me just... If I rearrange these... Done. Which one are we talking about? Are we talking about like three? Is it three New Vegas or four in space? 
Because if it's four in space, I might have a problem. No joke. Some of the guns look straight out of Fallout, but less jank. Oh, this architecture. They got Microsoft money. The sun is a giant laser that's powering the fucking planet. Ah. Those are not Pythagorean symbols. 43, 39, 19, N. 75, 27, 42, double. Nothing. The cult of Hermes is wrong. The number is meaningless. You are leaving? No mere number can repair the world. Come, my friend. Help me charter a ship to Nevada. I must finish with Cesare Borgia. It is not intended for us. Ezio, what are you not telling me? What else are you working on? Well, I have begun several dissection studies. Then King Louis XII seems interested in hiring me as an engineer. Oh, yes, I'm thinking of repainting the St. John lost in the Villa Fire. Salai would model for it again, of course. Then perhaps I will study a woman... Just get him to talk about his stuff. He'll changes. be fine. Interesting. Tell me more. can sedate Desmond now. We have the information we needed. I mean, we got backgrounds so you can stat the game with three kids and then dead. What? <laughs> I'm confused. What is that supposed to mean? Well, on top of being confused, we're also done with the DLC. And that means we're done with the game. So let, let me get to a... You can start the game in debt. <laughs> so you can start the game as a millennial? <laughs> or the, the space equivalent? Indentured servitude in space! Look at the city. Some factions will hate you based on your other factions. I mean, at least they're starting to make sense with that. Like, unlike Skyrim, where it's like, yeah, I can, I'm the, I'll be the leader of the Thieves Guild. Yeah, sure. I'll be the leader of the Companions, the people who want to safeguard all of all of Skyrim, but sure, I'll also join the Dark Brotherhood and talk to a mummified corpse in a box. <laughs> Those two make absolute perfect sense to be led by the same person. <laughs> anyway. Yep, we've finished the main campaign and we finished the DLC, which means Brotherhood is done. Uh, my next upcoming stuff will be Saturday, which will be Elden Ring night, and then when my five starts next week, uh, we'll start Revelations, so that I can get working on that game before they cut it off. Mage Guild. Here be the Archmage. Why? I don't want to. <laughs> like, you don't even really get a choice in the matter whether or not to be the Archmage or not. You're just... 
you were just the closest person that happened to be next to him when he died. So it's just like, uh, you, you, you're the arts page now. Have fun. And you're like, I don't, I don't want to do that. What are you talking about? And they're just like shoving all the paperwork in your face. And you're like, ah, da, ah. And then if you're like any of the characters I play, you run away and never go back to the College of Winterhold again. Because as soon as I'm done with the mi those missions there, I run away. <laughs> but yeah, this Saturday, Saturday will be Elden Ring, so come back by for that. And next week we'll start Revelations. So I would like to say... Thank you to everyone. Me with the Warhammer and Daedric Armor. Yep, definitely mage, alright. <laughs> I would like to tell everyone thank you for showing up. Thank you, Sloths, for coming in when you did and talking to me about stupid video game bullshit. Thank you to everyone who decided to drop by if you like what you see, drop me a follow so that you can be notified whenever I come back on. And I will see you all next time. Later. Oh, God. Oh, God. OBS. No. Bye.